<coughs> Alrighty then. So, been building this quail enclosure. Uh, started last weekend. And I'll finish it up this weekend. Well, kind of finish it. It won't be completely finished. It is... 16 feet long and no it's not square no it's not level and eight feet wide got the door here this is my high-tech latch take that off swing door open <coughs> I've got some more uh, joists to put up and I haven't decided on what kind of roof I'm gonna put on it uh, but anyway, as you can see, it's all screened in with chicken wire along the sides. I've got some holes to fill <coughs> right there. That's all right. No big deal. I'll fill them in. Uh, along the outside of this thing, now, to keep predators out, this chicken wire is not going to keep out a dedicated coyote. It's just not going to happen. So, all along the outside, I'm going to put plastic insulators all along here. And all along the outside, I'm going to string three or four strands of electric fence wire. And then... I'll mount a charger to that post and uh, charge that puppy up so that uh, the wire will be live along the ground right along in here I'm gonna put down hardware cloth all the way around it and the ground lead of the fence charger Will be hooked up to the hardware cloth the live lead or positive lead of the fence charger will be hooked up to the fence wire that way any critter that comes by standing on the hardware cloth and sticking its nose in the fence wire will get a serious zap so anyway uh, that's progress so far it's not doing too bad not sure how much longer I'm going to work out here. Probably uh, another 20 minutes or so. Maybe uh, get some more uh, joists up. And then I'll call it a day for today. Um, putting the chicken wire up. I use this Harbor Freight uh, stapler. And this thing's done really good. Uh, I started out with a box of 2,500 uh, staples, and I'm down to that right now. It's had a few misfires, but nothing to worry about. And all run off of this little bitty air compressor right here. All right, that's it, folks. Later. <laughs>